You know, hockey's a metaphor for life. Think about it. Sometimes you coast through it. Sometimes there's obstacles in the way. Sometimes you need to work hard to achieve your goals. But for the most part, it's just a bunch of guys trying to score. All right, so I found a couple of buddies of mine out here on the rink. This is Mo, Nick, Paul. Obviously, we're all hockey players, but have you ever been called a player off the ice? I have. I know one, you're a player. I have once, but it was yeah. it was misinterpreted. <laughs> if you have maybe a couple girlfriends and you're honest with all of them, that's not necessarily being a player. That's called good work. Well, I mean, you're not going to the movies, but what if you just have some sushi and sex on a Wednesday? <laughs> wow, that's a great combo, actually. You guys, have you ever been played before? Yeah, I have. You have? And I'll tell you something. Doesn't feel good. You think you, you you're going down one road, and the next thing you know, you're not even on the same road. You're in a different county. You're hitchhiking. And it's all one giant game. We're all. Pretty big players. Why don't we play this game for a little bit? Ow! Oh! Oh, really? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Paul just learned to skate. So, if you're a hockey player, you know what a puck bunny is. The thing about puck bunnies is that they're very aggressive. Uh, have you ever experienced a, like an overly aggressive girl? There's nothing I think sexier than confidence in a girl, but. Like anything, if you're too confident, that can be a total turnoff. Every guy likes a little bit of a chase. They like to feel like they're the ones working for it. They like to feel like it's a challenge for them. I mm. can't play cool. If I'm really into a girl, I mean, I'm calling four or five times uh, every hour. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, what are some other game changers when it comes to the dating. All of a sudden, day two, they're they're ready for marriage. That's that's not a good thing. Why haven't you changed your status yet? Why haven't you changed your status? Why it? haven't you changed your status Mo, yet, Mo? It's, it's a control thing. Right. right. Let let the guy or girl make the decision for him or herself. Yeah. I think a green flag uh, when you throw them in the lion's den is in she comes and meets all your buddies, and the red flag is definitely uh, body odor. No, sorry, <laughs> sorry, honey. What to you guys is the ultimate girlfriend, the Stanley Cup of all girls? And I think the most important thing, it's something that's lost on a lot of girls today, and guys, I say, is compassion and kindness and taking care of your man. Well, I'd say, yeah, I mean, definitely personality, uh, right at the top. It's followed uh, just closely behind my looks. Down to earth, real, spontaneous, fun, a best friend. Yeah. Nice. I care a I'm single. My ultimate girlfriend is just pretty much anyone who hasn't dated any of you plugs. Ah, That's Bailey. Oh, I love that. I would love that. <laughs>